We've heard it time and time again. It's been a hard year. So let's focus on the good things that have happened at the College of Pharmacy and Health Sciences in 2020. Our students have impressive pass rates. Nursing posted a 90.7% pass rate on the state boards. Pharmacy was above both state and national averages on the NAPLEX as well as the MPJE. And our PA program boasts a first time pass rate of 98% on the PAS. As you can imagine, experiential education was extremely impacted this year, but our programs were successful in securing these valuable and important positions for our students. We sincerely appreciate our clinical partners. Thank you for your help. We also recognize the impact this year has had on our alumni and friends. Thank you for your service and continued care for our community. Our faculty and staff have been awarded more than $500,000 in grants to conduct research on projects ranging from rural community care during COVID-19 to the treatment of cocaine abuse. The Office of Interprofessional Education held three summer webinars with expert panelists to share information about the pandemic and its impact. Based on student feedback, the office also initiated an innovative new event named REPS that offers direct instructional opportunities focused on the roles and responsibilities of each profession on the healthcare team. We started the first Doctor of Health Sciences program in North Carolina and welcomed 20 students into the initial cohort for this 100% online degree. Another online program we kicked off this year was the RN to BSN. We are still accepting applications, so tell all your friends. We welcome Dr. Priscilla Weaver as the new chair and director of the physical therapy program. Thanks, David. It's great to be here. Even with the challenges this year presented, Campbell and CPHS have continued to educate students for excellence. We transitioned to virtual learning in the spring with outstanding planning and preparation from the Campbell Task Force and with input from our very own Dr. Wes Rich, we were able to bring students back to campus this fall. And while our students are resilient and resourceful, they sometimes need extra support. With this in mind, we established the CPHS Student Relief Fund to support the immediate needs of students in all of our programs. If you would like to contribute to the fund, text CPHS Relief Fund to the number 71777 and follow the link. In addition to these achievements, our faculty, staff, and students have many more accolades than we can talk about today, and each of those can be found on the CPHS website and on our social media channels. On behalf of everyone at CPHS, we wish you and yours a joyous Christmas season and a very happy new year. Merry, Merry Christmas! Christmas. Merry Christmas.